Ladies and gentlemen, if you're watching us live on Twitch, please follow. If you're watching it on YouTube for the, you know, the, the main clips, uh, the watch along, this watch along tonight, um, as Scott Brown plays his final home game for Celtic. Very sad. We'll talk a bit more in the discussion of the recent video out on my channel in a wee minute. Um, and obviously the main clips will go into the main, like the three things we learned very well also go into that wee clip video as well. So you'll see it at the end guys. But welcome to the watch, uh, the watch long or reaction, um, depending on you where you're watching it. If you're on Twitch and YouTube. Um, as you say, Celtic are taking on St. Johnston live at Celtic Park. Of course it's six, it's a half six kickoff. Um, and we're going to discuss a bit more into detail of what my recent video is guys. Um, but yeah, guys, um, it's going to be a set, you know, in the middle of the occasions, you know, Scott Brown's last home game at Celtic Park, I think it was, you know, it was a te it's terrible what was going on at um, Palestine, you know, the, the amount of people were getting killed and, you know, sadly losing their lives, and uh, the, it just shows even the Super League, they were treating us like customers, all they want is the money, and um, they don't want anything else, I mean, they're costing... Just for Scott Brown on the back of the, a bit like this, the, the green one, the green home, the green home one, uh, of this thing, right? And just to get Brown in the back, £70. They just want money. They, they want the club to get out the, the fans' pockets. Still going through a, a, a wide, wide world pandemic. They want to get £70 for one of these. I mean, I got this is on sale, right? Just to say, right? But £70 just to get Brown in the back, that just shows you something as well. Doesn't it not? You know? Um, I will talk in more detail, guys. We'll definitely talk in more detail as the game goes on. Um, the game starts, sorry. So, I'll do the uh, team again, just to... So I can do it on... Uh, so the people on YouTube know as well. Um, it's Barkas Brown, Turnbull Kenny, Christy Edward, Illinusi Ayer Forest, Montgom Montgomery, Welsh. So there's a place for Montgomery. No Taylor, Lacks out as well. They're on the bench as well as Hazard, um, Taylor Griffiths, Ayeti Soro, Mickey Johnson, Ralston, Carmel Kondomeli and obviously Laxalt. Barkas back in the team, obviously for an injured Bain. Uh, Brown's last game at Celtic Park would be disappointing. I don't know why he's going. Again, is it the board that's doing it? We don't know. Um, maybe the board have not offered them the right contract or such, you know, we don't know. Uh, but we need definitely a change. Um, Montgomery coming to the side left back. Um, I'm, oh, I'm pretty sure because um, Taylor or Laxalt are not playing. Kenny again. I mean, we should be starting as I said in my preview. I've said hundreds of times we should be playing the players that are going to be here next season. You know, um, all right, Brown. We got you know it's, it's his last ever his last ever game at City Park. Okay, fair point. But um, Barkas could not be here next season potentially. Um, could be a flop or a you can many words for a. What South, uh, Celtic players went down for many years um, for bad, uh, for being, you know, probably worse. Um, Kenny won't be there. Christy probably. Edward. El Yunusi won't be there. Ayo, you're talking as well. Forrest will be there. Montgomery will be there. And Welsh. You're talking from the start in 11 alone. You're talking Welsh, Montgomery, Welsh, Montgomery, Forrest, um, Turnbull, Brown. And maybe Barkas. So it's six players out of the starting eleven. So you're talking there. Um, on the bench, Hazard will be there. Taylor will be there. Maybe Griffiths. You know. Uh, but anyway, uh, we're an hour from kickoff. Um, guys, there is that. There we go. Fans at Parkhead. I think that's a Cotton Brown and a few men, of course. All oh, the Palestine flags as well there as well. Good to see. Good to see that as well. And yeah. Here come the players and they're all wearing the zippers with the, the Captain Lewis Legend in 2021. I mean I was born in 2007. Wait, we have Barkas and they all have brown in the back yet. Um it's ridiculous, so they'll charge us seventy pounds for that. They charge all about the all about the money, eh? Even when the Super League was going, as I said, you know. They just want money, you know. You want, you know, I'm glad to see Dom McKayan. Um, but let's go on to the football matter. Um, the game is about to kick off. Um, obviously, the teams are out. Brown is there. Last home game of the season. Good, good to see. Obviously, St. Johnson getting to the, the Scottish Cup final. They beat St. Mirren 2-1. Um, they could be on a cup double. Um, so, it'll be interesting to see that.
Hopefully you'll get a good performance. Um, it's sad to see you can't get the best of send off, but we got the we tried our hardest. You know we got got the banner done, um, which will try and make it even b b a bit better for him. Um, but um, hopefully we got a good performance, guys. I'm going for a two one Celtic, two one Celtic, guys. We can keep strong. Yeah, I'm going for a two two one Celtic. Um, Brown to score the second goal, a cracker goal. Um, he's going to score a cracker. I tell you, I can feel it. Um, so hopefully it does, guys. Hopefully it does. It's a free kick to St. Johnson. I don't know how that's a free kick and the, the Kenny one wasn't, but St. Johnson will take this one. It's a long ball out wide. Who's marking him? Where's Montgomery? Cross in. Lucky there's no St. Johnson player and Kenny has to put out for a Celtic throw. Uh, St. Johnson throw on the far side. Who was marking? Who there? There was n There's nobody there. Like, Middleton is there, but he's not fast. Um, not close enough to the player to stop the cross. The cross goes along. Luckily, there's no St. Johnson player there. And that was an early chance for St. Johnson. Four minutes gone. Still nothing. No, no. Throw into St. Johnson. It's a good block. And Celtic get it back now with Forrest. Turnbull. Brown. Nice wee ball over to Montgomery. Chest down. Good control back to Ayer. Over to... Oh, Jesus... Welsh there nearly puts out for a, 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 a corner there and that'll go out for a, a St. Johnson play uh, a St. John's throne. We're getting nervous here, we're getting nervous. There's no need for it. Uh, we can't, can't we can need to calm down a bit. Uh, need to calm down. Here comes St. Johnston. Played it short. Good block. And I don't know if it was Ayer or Welsh. Edward as well intercepted. Here comes Celtic now. Christie on the attack. Oh Christie, what a that was a great attack. Edward got it back. And he passed it to Christine. Christie, all he had to do was pass an HB ball wide, and he didn't need that, man. Now, St. Johnson have it. I didn't need that, man. Good passing here from Celtic in the box. Forrest, oh, it's just before it was nearly out of Forrest, but the St. Johnson player gets there by the slightest of margins, gets cleared. <coughs> Montgomery into Brown. Turnbull back to Brown. Now, wide to Montgomery. Has to go back to Brown. Montgomery, no, that uh, will be a St. John's throw. We're getting in the game a bit, we're getting in the game a bit. Here comes St. John's cross in, heads on, and it's a sitter from, it looks like, um, is it Chris Kane or Middleton, I don't know. It was a lovely ball in from St. Johnson, and they should be one a lot, but it's a pure defending. Ayer on his own, slips, crosses in, heads on, and I don't know if it was Kane or Middleton, header it was so close the head's on and the, he needs that wee touch of the foot and it's going in it was chris kane and he was so close to going in for st johnson nearly making a one nil st johnson but um it was the ball was a bit too far from but that was a close opportunity for st johnson but still nine minutes gone now now key chance there from celtic is it uh the say um i would say it seemed that forest was that way they tried to chip it over but they the, the the defensive player in really was getting the head at the back to the keeper Zamal. So it was unlucky there. It was about thirteen and a half months gone. Yeah. When St Johnson are not in possession, they're just trying to defend, squeeze Celtic into positions that they can't get the ball to I don't know, cross the ball, they'll block it or something like that. But when they're on the ball they're really good. He got Celtic on the ball now. Turn Montgomery. Oh Eunice is still on it. Turn ball. Christie. Shoots, it's blocked, and it will go into the hands as a mile. No trouble there. It was a chance, but it was not much, really. Um, it was blocked in the end. As I said, if it went off the ball, they'll try and block every shot, squeeze Celtic into the, the uncomfortable positions and stuff. Um, and when St. Johnson are on the ball, they're really good so far. Here comes St. Johnson now, speak of it. We're off the, we're, we've got three players on this guy, and they still can't tackle him. Annoying. Right, come on, pressure the pressure on man. But there's no point just standing there watching him pass the ball. That's it. Pressure him. Make him do something. That's it. Elliot, so go on, Elsie. Wins it back from Rooney. It's a poor one. And Edward, oh, you jab me. Oh, that was very lucky. That's what I mean by pressure him. You got to do something when they don't know what they're doing. Rooney didn't know what he's doing. Elliot was pressuring him, and I think it was um Turnbull was pressuring him at the same time. 
Uh, at least he actually got the ball from it, uh, Rooney because he didn't know what he was going to do with it and it was almost a goal scoring chance. That's what we need to do in the game to get a goal. And it goes back to small. 21 minutes on the clock and it's... It will be a... Oh! Pass back! Yes! It's a... Indirect free kick. Am I right? It's a pass back from somebody and it will be a free kick for Celtic in a good position. Yep, I was right. In, inside the box, indirect free kick. It was a pass back. He should know Brazil's uh, Rural Samal. He's from Hearts. Uh, it was a emergency one, as I said at the start of the stream, um, from Hearts because obviously their players got COVID like uh, under Clark. So, yeah. Turnbull. It's got to be Turnbull. I, I mean, I see Christie at it because it's just Christie, but I want Turnbull with it. Maybe he'll hit it on target. But look at the walls that Johnson are making. I don't think they'll get the ball through the wall, to be honest. Um, it's a good position, but I don't see anything happening. The referee will pull his whistle. It's Turnbull who hits it. And it's a goal! David Turnbull! Get it in! Yes. David Turnbull! The jump! They actually jump! <laughs> and it's Celtic 1, St. Johnson now, 22 minutes gone. To a lovely. Christy lays it off a wee touch and it beats them out. Look at that, lovely, lovely shot from Turnbull and Celtic lead 1-0 on Scott Brown's last game at Celtic Park and it's David Turnbull, lovely, lovely finish and it's Celtic 1, St Johnson 0, 22 and 40 seconds on the clock. David Turnbull, I'm telling you, what a player, no wonder he won player of the year and stuff and it's now Celtic 1, it's Celtic 1, St Johnson 0 and Told you he would score. Ah, he's going to be crucial next season as well. Edward, it's 2 0. It's 2 0. I don't believe it. Inside seconds, uh, David Turnbull scoring the first goal. It's 2 0 Celtic. It's Edward. It's Scott Brown. Let's look at that again here. It's a lovely wee chip ball over the top. The Aber uh, St. John's defence. They're all over the pace. Edward, a lovely touch. Chip over to Jamal, it's Celtic 2, St Johnston 0, and it's game, game setting match down. It's a lovely, look at that nutmeg, lovely wee nutmeg over uh, Rooney there, and a wee chip over the keeper, Jamal. Brown, I told you he was going, ever going to get a goal or assist, he got a lovely wee assist for Edward, and it's Celtic 2. It's Celtic 2, St Johnston 0. Lovely finishes and it's Celtic 2. St Johnson now inside minutes, seconds. Celtic were unselfish there. Um, it was Christie there, it was unselfish. Um, uh, yeah, as I said, the commentator saying Celtic just came in life for the last few seconds. You know, the goals came in in seconds to David Turnbull's lovely free kick. And Turnbull, speaking of Turnbull, you take this corner. Uh, Christie was unselfish, it could have been three, Turn uh, Christie was going to shoot, but he tried to get Edward, uh, the corner's taken short by Turnbull, uh, Forrest back to Turnbull, Edward, oh, Forrest will back way it, across in, Edward, oh, right across the goal, Edward, if Edward touched it a slightest, it was going in, maybe he did touch it, but he needed a wee bit more touch, oh, Edward, oh, he'd be kicking himself there, he did get the second, but that could have been his second goal of the game, and Celtic stud, unlucky there, 25 months gone. Celtic have definitely come into life here. We're pressing him now, that's it. Ayer does well in there. Turnbulls and Edward Christie, good first touch. No, the pass isn't it, but first touch was alright. Ball, Welsh. Mm, now Kenny has it for Celtic. Um, to Montgomery out wide to El Unice. Turnbull. Montgomery. Turnbull. Turnbull plays a nice wee ball out wide to John Joe Kenny. Actually keeps it in John Joe Kenny. 
Forrest, nice wee one-two. Now for it, John Joe Kenny cross in. Can he find a Celtic player? Brown. And it's Ignacy gets a wee touch. Brown will get the touch on to Forrest. Back to Welsh. Brown. Forrest out to Kenny. And to Christie out wide to Montgomery now. Oh, Montgomery does well to keep it in. Always wanting the ball, as the commenters say. Turnbull. Ayer, back to Turnbull, yeah. We nice wee chip ball over to Stephen Welsh. And to Christie. Forrest. Edward. Oh, can't get it ever. Brown will pick it up, though. Edward. That's a surely a free kick, ref. No, okay. Oh, that's a free kick. Welsh. Um, tactical foul, some may say, but there you go. We're not letting them, not letting them take the quick, no. Brown there, uh, Bruno. Does he? Oh, they obviously got to, got to do it, bro. He's got to do it, you know. But oh, a free kick to St. Johnson, 27 minutes gone. Uh, a turnbull. Um, oh, no. Oh, what a save. <laughs> what a save from Barkas. I tell you what, Barkas, save of the season. Game and award. That's actually a lovely save from Barkas. Um, Kenny is very lucky. Look at this chip. A hand from Barkas saves it. And look at this. Barkas, lovely save. And Kane, if he had a wee bit more on it, it would have went a goal. But it was a header right in the bloody Chris Kane from K Kenny. The finger touches a, um, of um, Barkas. It saves it from where it takes the power out and he grabs onto it. Edward Brown. Lovely wee play. Christy turns out wide to Forrest now. Cross in. It's a lovely wee cross. Turnbull nearly gets to Edward and it's cleared. Montgomery will pick it up. Aye. Go again, you're over. See, half an hour in this game. Um, 15 minutes to go till half time. Here comes. Forrest. Christie. Brown. Back to Christie. We cross over. He nearly finds Turnbull. I'll tell you what. Nearly finds him. It's a good block from Christie. It'll be at St. John's in front. Or Edward. Or else it was Edward. And it would be in his second of the night. And third for Celtic. But it was a good defence. It was a lovely pass into Edward. Just couldn't get there first. Um, got the vital touch. And it could have been a goal. Uh, it'll be a corner kick to Celtic though. It'll be a Turnbull to take it. A nice wee ball in. Turnbull gives a wee Turnbull ball in and somebody get on it. Turnbull takes it short. Turnbull. Oh! Christie! It's blocked! It was a lovely wee stuff stuff on the train is uh, the ground there. Christie! And it's St. John's so get it clear. <coughs> well, they have it anyway. Uh, Welsh tries to get it back and it's blocked and it'll be a St. John's in front. Unusi, Turnbull, what a goal, oh, I thought it was a goal, oh it was close to being a second of the night for Turnbull and the third goal for Celtic, oh he tried to get it to that back post, oh we wee bit more turn it would have went into, and it was unlucky, uh, very unlucky from Turnbull and Unusi, very good play, netting from El Unusi there, very unlucky not to make it 3-0 to Celtic, Turnbull very unselfish, Christie plays a nice wee ball wide. Turnbull. Oh, you see, just could have done a wee bit better. And it could have been 3-0 to Celtic. Unlucky. Very unlucky. Hmm, I wouldn't say that. Forrest. Christie save. Good, good save from Zamal. That was a lovely, lovely play from Celtic again. St. Johnston. Oh, they don't get it clear. Comes Kenny. Crosses in. There's nobody there. It falls. No. St. Johnson will no, Elwin's just still chasing it down. Oh, we forget to find straight to Edward. Edward, oh, he couldn't just couldn't get it to Forrest. Edward touches it down very well. He still has it, Edward. Beats another man. Back to Brown. He does well. Brown does well again. Skill shown off. Last game at Celtic Park. You got it though. Turnbull. And he Christie can't. Brown. Come on, get his goal, Brown. I'd love to see him get a goal, but 
couldn't get the space there to get the shot off, and Kenny slid, couldn't, uh, slid in to try and get the block, but Forrest gets it now. We'll go back to Welsh, Brown. We're fast football here from City of Celtic here, Turnbull. El Unice, Edward, and he, Montgomery, if he can keep it and he creeps it and crosses in, Zamal has to get there and he does. Good goalkeeping there from Zamal in the end. Uh, very good play from Celtic though, and there's three minutes to go to, uh, four minutes to half time. Still Celtic 2, St Johnson 0. Montgomery does well, he crosses it in, it's just a cross in the end. Edward maybe could have done a wee bit better with the pass, or Montgomery could have a bit better with the, you know, run, but to be often, he's done very well, Montgomery and Edward. Very good. You know, say, oh, just nearly good at an ape. In the box, you know, still has it. Crosses it in, it's cleared again from St. Johnson. But, uh, yeah, it'll go out for a throw in. And the first time, Montgomery will take the throw in for Celtic. Turnbull. Yeah, I totally agree with the commentator there, Darren Adi. When the St. John's still clearing it, they're straight off just passing it to Celtic again. Lovely one with two Forest. It's Kenny. It's blocked. It's headed on. The cart clears. Welsh heads on to Brown. Brown heads back to Ayer. He'll go to Welsh. That was a nice play, a nice wee ball out wide to McGummery. Into Edward, back to Turnbull. Can you get another goal before half time? Edward does well, needs to be turn. Edward, that's a good tackle. El Unice. Turnbull. El Unice just couldn't get the. Somebody could have went that run. It was a good be pass to from El Unice, but nobody was there. Uh, uh, Welsh heads on. Very good defender, too, what we're doing there. Except from that Kenny header, you know, but. Yes, I'm not. Montgomery. Away to Edward. Edward's looking like he's playing that a weird position here. Here comes Edward. Oh, just a bit. The ball was just a bit. The pass was just a bit too far for El Unice. El Unice or it would have been a goal, I think, in my opinion. But very, very good play from Celtic here. And it will be a throw on the far side here. With Montgomery to take it. Um, two minutes to go to half time. Plus any added time, which I don't expect. Um, Turnbull. Uh, well, it was Johnson went it back. And it's played at the park. But they'll not get anywhere. I don't think they'll get anywhere. That's surely I felt. It's a free kick to St. Johnson. Don't really know, but there you go. It's a free kick to St. Johnson. Um, yeah. And it is half time at Celtic Park. It is Celtic 2. St. Johnson now, thanks to David Turnbull, a lovely free kick and a lovely wee finish from Edward, you know, cross field pass from uh, Scott Brown over the top of the defence, they didn't know where they were, St. Johnson defence, and Edward, lovely wee skill to get it past um, the Ro uh, Rooney, and then um, the chip over Zamal to make it 2-0. Um, it was a great, very slow, slow um, shaky start from Celtic, and then they obviously got in the game with the goals, um, hopefully don't look and see the second half, I'm hoping. Um, maybe I got a couple more goals in the second half, that's all I can say of, you to be honest. Back for the second half, guys. Um, so to come out for the second half, two goals up. Um, obviously, the goals I explained with um, my half time. So, guys, um, hopefully, you enjoy the second half. Hopefully, a good one. That's Montgomery now, come on. Kenny. Christy, nice back pass to Kenny. Oh, nearly an own goal. Could potentially wear that ball. That St. Jones to play a kick to it, but it did go out for a corner kick. It was lovely one too. Kenny got it back. So we cross in, and the cross would have done better. Um, if that guy wasn't there, it uh, went put it out for a corner. Everyone still scored. It'll be a corner to Celtic. I think Turnbull will take it long this time. He will. Cross in. Brown nearly gets on the end of it, I tell you what. <laughs> 
He did well there, Montgomery, um, getting forward sealed it very well. I think Kenny started it and it all came in. Christy returned pass and Kenny in the end just oh, right over. Worse than a Christy shot. <laughs> uh, 40 minutes played. Still 2 0 Celtic. Yeah. Unlucky there. So Miles does well twice. Um, it was a good chance. Nice wee ball through. Uh, Christy from Brown. So Miles saves it first time. Then Forrest and Edward. It was Kenny, sorry. Edward again. Forrest actually gets the pass into Edward. Sorry, I was right. And then Edward just couldn't get the the shot away that he wanted. And, you know, the beat Samal. But Samal did well twice there. And it was unlucky not to be a couple of goals there for Celtic. But there you go. From a brown mistake, you know, it blocked off a Kane. And Kane did well. He won it. And they ran down the park. Wait support. The cross was in from St. Johnson. Nobody was there. But Brown, yet again, shows the defensive skills. Uh, did go for a, it's out for a corner though. Um, 54 and a half minutes gone. Still set at 2 0. Corner for St. Johnson here. Cross in. Heads on. It was Edward. Jeez, oh. Head again from St. Johnson, but Barkas is there to pick it up. Back up now the defenders there, Edward. Um, St. Johnson. Yeah, I'll go back. Okay, we're fine. Oh, God. Oh, yeah, good touch from Kenny, actually. But the Welsh, yeah. Off the line by Montgomery. St. Johnson again. It was Brown that loses it this time. Again, and um, it was young Montgomery on the line, or else it would have been 2-1. And it was a block the first time from... Oh, it was Montgomery that time. Again, it was a great... It was off the line was technically, and it was another mistake from Brown, but it wasn't costly though. Montgomery on the line to save us there. It was still Celtic 2 0, 57 minutes gone. Barkas will punt up the park. It's Johnson pressures now, but Stephen Welsh now on the ball. Montgomery back to Ayer. Welsh. Brown, it, it's, I don't know what's Brown doing now. I mean, he was playing excellent in the first half. Up with a free kick to St. Uh, St. Johnson here. We need to be careful. Definitely need to be careful because St. Johnson can easily get back in this game. You don't want that. You don't want that from St. Johnson. The Scottish Cup finalist double. We could be on for a double. You know, we cannot afford to um, give silly free kicks away, silly balls away to St. Johnson. Um, I'm hoping Barkas puts a good ball up. Um, I don't know what he'll do. I'm not actually because we've not actually seen him uh, play for Celtic since January. So I wonder what wall he will put up. You know, don't know. He looks like he's putting Christie and Edward closest to this free kick. But it'll be some free kick if this guy scores it. I tell you what, 58 minutes gone. He shoots and it's well. Well over the bar. I mean, it's nearly hitting our seats. I mean, right up the Lisbon line stand, right like the second, second tier. Oof, right up there. Mm, lucky there's no fans in the stadium, or else it would do. Hitting the heat. Was any trouble in Barkas there? We sorrow as Malas sorrow is getting prepared to come on for Celtic, looking like maybe potentially Brown. I don't think Brown will come off. I don't know. Maybe he will. Don't know, but and also Greg Taylor, I got my answers question by um, my question by. So there you go. Sign shot as well from Cal Mack and Taylor coming a couple of days time. They email me back and saying I'm getting um, 
they've sent it out the shirt to my address, so I go. But here comes the Johnston, but Brown does extremely well, and it'll be a goal kick straight. Brown defend from Brown last time, and a goal kick to Celtic. 59 minutes gone, nearly I never played at Celtic Park, still Celtic 2. St Johnston now prepared, Celtic are preparing to make two subs. There's a block there from Ayers, low pass, but Christie gets on in yet. Now Celtic can go forward now. Turnbull, just a heavy touch low, lets him down. Or oh, else he'll be down at, on the attack. For Celtic there, but we'll go out for a Celtic throw in. And I think those changes will be made. I think. No? No? Okay. Changes not going to be ready yet. But Brown. Maybe we'll get his 90 minutes, I'm not sure. Who is Malasaw is going to come on for. But Brown loses out, but Kenny wins it back. To Ayer. To Eurusen out. Over to Kenny. And if Christy, poor pass from Christy, but Brown does well. And so does El Unice to get it back. For Celtic. Here comes Christy. Out wide to Forest. Oh, it's a good tackle from St. Johnson there. But well, she'll get there. Um, and you go back to Ayer. It's Scott Brown, and it's the last thing for Scott Brown. 61, 62 minutes on the clock. The last time at Celtic Park, Scott Brown's hand over the armband to James Forrest. Scott Brown is coming off at Celtic Park for the last time, and... Brune, Brune, Brune. And he'll come off for his mouth sorrow and Greg Taylor will be coming on for having great words there with John Kennedy, laughs there. Absolute love, lovely, brilliant moments with Brown, the treble, the treble treble, the invincible season, the quadruple treble, all the great seasons we've had with him. Thank you, Scott Brown. Thank you. And Young Montgomery comes off for Greg Taylor. He'd put in a big shift, Montgomery for 62 minutes um, and that is the end of Scott Brown for Celtic Park, very very sad Montgomery also coming off for Greg Taylor so we'll make those changes now so it's Sorrow Sorrow oh god please no I'm trying to change the team here mate No, oh, put it in my teaser. Right, there we go. Oh, <laughs> I'm gone, guys. I'm done here. I'm back. <laughs> right. Oh, proud, very proud from Scott Brown. I'm absolutely brilliant um, scenes from. Oh, he does well at Aberdeen. We'll see him soon. Mm -hmm. Doing which cross in Edward. It's Edward a goal. It's surely a goal. Will you know say it's deflected off a is it Edward? Did it deflect off Edward? I think it did. Did it? It was a lovely play. Dumble, nice ball away to Forrest. Forrest, lovely cross in. Edward should have scored. Zamal saves oh no, it's a boot off a of Rooney. And it hits off Edward's boot. I think. I think. It does. Does it? I don't know. I don't know. We'll find out in a couple of minutes. To, well, now if, if it's a corner or not. I don't guys. Is it? No, it's not. It's a goal kick. Okay. Forest. It's a snake stake. Putting the defence. Forest is blocked. Turnbull. It's cleared before Turnbull gets hit at it. Ayer heads on. Taylor will get there. It's a mistake from St John's defence, but put in Forest actually. Sorrow back to Christie. Celtic make it free. Turnbull to Christie. Forest. Edward. Turnbull finds it back to Edwards. Oh, I just can't get the ball through. St Johnston defence in the end. Try to play the ball and bind to Kane, but Welsh does well. He'll find Sorrow. 
and we're back to Ayer. Turnbull. Kenny. <laughs> Tries a ball into Edward. What a ball from Kenny. Edward, that's a poor shot. A bit off balance here. It's a conversation from uh, Edward. It's a lovely wee ball over from Kenny though. Change looks like, or oh, I don't know if there's five subs, but anyway, Mike Johnson's coming on the park for the last 19 minutes or so in the game. <laughs> hey, we just say, okay, it looks like it's going to come off. Um, Welsh into nice wee pie, a play from Celtic, yeah, turn to uh, Christie. He finds the pass to Taylor. Cross in. T oh, nearly from Forrest. There was no takers. I thought Forrest was going to hit it. Edward looked like he was going to header it. Chris, uh, Ed Forrest looked like he was going to hit it. He, 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 he passed it along the goal. I thought he was just going to hit it, but maybe from the angle it wasn't good enough. But Elliot is going to come off for Mikey Johnston. So, and Lee Griffiths is coming on. For how you been? What? The? Edwards got the second goal of the night, and he is going to come off for Lee Griffiths. Does well, uh, the man Lee Griffiths, uh, uh, Edward. And now you know say it's coming off for Johnson. Oh, there we go. That right, is the changes. So they play forward now. Oh, it's a slack pass. And they will. Celtic still has it though. Mikey Johnson, Turnbull, Taylor. What a pop, Taylor. Oh, what a save! What a save from Zamal. I thought Greg Taylor was hitting bloody top right hand corner there. Are you sure he's a right back? Are you sure he's a left back? I don't think he is. I think he's a striker. Get him on the striker. I think he's a left winger. Look at this. A lovely strike from Taylor. It looked like he was going top right hand corner to Zamal has to save it and it's a good save. And it'll be a corner kick obviously, but it's a good save from Zamal. Looked like Taylor was gonna smash the net open with that one. Um substitution for St Johnston. It looks the substitution it looks like Conway is coming off. And it's whoa with a spoon. Or a spoon. I think it's got a very long name, it's just why does it have to have a long name? I mean but anyway. So out of the corner. Can I make it free now? Tumble was thinking about it taking the short, but he's gonna take it. Cross in. Oh, nearly felt the eye up. Taylor heads on. It's headed clear from oh uh, uh, St John's the play there. Finds sorrow. And we'll go back to Kenny. Oh great save. Or else that was a going in, a lovely bullet header. Lovely cross in from um, John Joe Kenny and get like the Griffiths is bullet header nearly went in. It's a lovely cross, a lovely header. Zamal has to pull off a good save again. Mr. Farrier, the 
Christopher Iyer finally gets a goal for Celtic and it's not what he said, it's with his feet. I don't believe it. Brown's laughing at the sidelines because Christopher Iyer, the centre-back, the, the big Norwegian, has got a goal tonight on the score sheet. It's Celtic feet, took a deflection off the short shoot player and went in the back of the net. It was a ball from Mikey Johnson, lovely We pass from Mikey Johnson and the shot from Christopher was good, it did a deflection, we'll take the goals, and it's Celtic free, St Johnson, that was a lovely wee finish from Ayer, you know, and Christopher Ayer makes it onto the goal sheet tonight, and it's Celtic free, St Johnston now, Christopher Ayer, Forrest is coming off for, Forrest came off for Dembele there, Karamoko Dembele is on the park, That's great goal there from Ayer. Position for two subs for um for St Johnson, sorry. What the what? There you go. Right. So the subs for Right, okay. If I'm a second guys, I'm sorry, but So Ferguson is coming on it came on for Gilmore. And there we go. And that's the subs for St. Johnson there. Belly. Yes, it's Carabao Code and Belly. Gets his first senior goal for Celtic. Uh, what a way to do it. Well, the season's over, but it's Celtic 4 0 and 5 minutes to play. Karamoko Dumbelli gets his first senior goal. It's a lovely finish. Look at this lovely pass from Turnbull. He's hitting Karamoko. Look at this goal. Look at that. Beats him out. And it's a lovely finish from the youngster. It's Celtic 4. Um, Karamoko 0. Uh, Karamoko 0. What? What? What am I even saying? It's Celtic 4, St. Johnson now. A lovely wee finish from the youngster. I got another youngster there. There we go. We got him up on the goal, the goal sheet. And it's about four minutes to play. Here comes St. Johnson, ball at the top. Kenny does well. Barkas as well. Gets it clear. Half a bit. Man of the match goes to Bruno. Last time we'll hear that at party, they say. That's the point. And then there was last time just there for St. Johnson there. Robertson coming on there. But Bruno picks up the daff a bit man of the match. Five seconds to go in this game. That'll go. Oh, Welsh as well. I thought Barker's just going to get it, but. And it's surely over. It's over at Paradise. It's Brown smiles as his Celtic career nears to an end, as his, as his last game at Celtic Park ends. It's all over for Brown at Celtic Park. It's over at Celtic. It's Celtic 4. 
It's still day four, St. Johnson now where Edward, Turnbull, um, Christopher Ayer and Young Karamoko get the goals tonight. Uh, Brown got a good assist. Um, Brown got definitely better man of the match. Um, you know, we could take positive some game, definitely, you know. Um, you know, um, you know, Young Karamoko getting the goal sheet, you know, he came on very good. Montgomery playing for 66, uh, 60 to 60, uh, 66 minutes, you know. Brilliant to play. Turnbull, especially, is going to be crucial next season. I think we're definitely sure I think it's going to be Eddie Howe now. Barker's played a wee bit. You know, we saw, you know, it's not really, really never done anything, to be honest, except from the one save in the first half, which was good. Um, do you know what? It was a good game um, when Celtic got into it, um, obviously. So, I'll let you listen to Scott Brown, what they have to say, and then I'll end, guys. Scott, I should just put my title, Scott Brown Squares are, Squares, Squares, uh, Squares live on, on uh, Celtic TV. <laughs> Oh, definitely, it was definitely the Zelda man in the match. Oh, definitely, since probably, don't even know. Don't know who's going to replace him. There you go. Scott Brown leaves a good farewell message to all Celtic fans. And I will see you guys. Um, please subscribe and like and follow on Twitch. What a stream it was. I think we did very well. Um, I think one of the stream, one of the, during the stream got up to three viewers, which is great. Um, on YouTube, guys, there will be the reaction and stuff. But, but play good, you know. Um, you know, there's nothing else much to say about that, to be honest. Um, and I'll see you guys um, for the last game of the season against Tibbs. Um, probably see you for the preview and then the um, the three things going because I won't have time to do the um, the watch long because I'm doing something Saturday. So um, until then, guys, peace.